After spending weeks in Bar, we make our way to Herzegnovi, a charming city located next to the border of Croatia. Traveling by bus is a great option to get into the city. It's inexpensive, the bus is also on time and clean. As a bonus, your eyes will be pleased with a beautiful panoramic view along the way. Hello everyone! Hello! Good morning! Good morning! I'm Max. I'm Shirley. So today we are in Erzegnovi, it's a coastal mm -hmm. town in Montenegro at the border with Croatia. Yeah. We are going to explore the city a little bit, walk around the promenade, yeah. explore the harbor and the yeah. town. Old town, yes. Yeah. Come with us. He sprained his ankle. Nice. Mm. First day we arrived. So this city is full of uh, these little streets, full stairs. of stairs. Yeah. yeah? Uh, they leads you either to the main road before or uh, look at the cat. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> wants to be in the video. Mm. Or uh, yeah, to the to the sea. So here we are in the promenade. This is the kind of hot spot for people, especially locals. And they walk around. Mm. Here is full of bars, uh, mm. restaurants. People rent a boat or they can do a boat tour. I don't know if you can see in the distance, far there, there is Croatia, you can see Croatia. The weather these days is getting warm, so you can see many people bathing and suntan. Walking along the promenade is really enjoyable. You get a sense of how the locals live in their daily life. Enjoy the fresh air, crystal clear water, and take a dip at one of the beaches around is a must thing to do here. Check also the port, where you can charter a boat for an island tour, or have a glass of beer in front of the beach. These are the best ways to enjoy the city. Since it's lunch time and we're getting really hungry, we're looking for a place to eat. We are here in the restaurant after walking around trying to find something that open and finally... Oh, this place is nice. What's the name of this dish, man? So this is Burmaska Pleskavica, which mm. is a kind of pork and beef burger. So look, it's crispy, the onion inside, cheese, Mamma mia, I just can't wait. And then, deep with the oil. Ah. Buonissimo. Spaghetti di frutti di mare. Ai, ai frutti di mare. Spaghetti ai frutti di mare. Vai. Well, spaghetti, this is tagliatelle. It smells really good. Honest opinion. One out of ten. Not say seven. Huh? I wish the tagliatelle a bit. Oh yeah, they kind of uh, well cooked. Mm. But since I like it, I don't mind. <sighs> Finish our lunch. <laughs> yes. Finally, we full and sleepy. Yeah. We heading towards the old town. Mm -hmm. Walk around a little bit, mm -hmm. show you around. But inside the fortress, yeah. we pay two euro each. So from here you can see all the forts, even that oh, yeah, one area, are... Igalo. Oh, Igalo, yes. Igalo. Yeah, over there is pretty much where we live. And nice. that's the Mount... Uh, Orien. Orien, yes. Oh, yeah. And this is the other side. Yeah. Over there, there is a, a Bay of Kotor. Mm. This Adriatic Sea. Over there, Croatia. That's great! Our trip isn't complete without visiting this fortress. It's the symbol of Herzegnovi. Many are coming to understand more of the history or simply enjoying the spectacular view of the town. So 
this is the main square of the old town. A few coffee shops, restaurants, church. Is banks. That's it in the old town. Let's go back home. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. What did you get? Local beer. That's the best, it's huh? The best one in uh, Montenegro, Nikšić. That's where we live. There. Look at these boys. They're so friendly. Bravo. Hello. What's your name again? My name is Gligo. Gligo? My name is Max. Hello. I'm Shirley. Max. Max. My name is... My name is Marco. Marco. Cosida. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you guys. Ciao. Ciao. Bye. Welcome to our messy bedroom. <laughs> but the view look at that any tips for those who wants to visit Herzeg Novi? yeah so if you are on the way to Croatia from Montenegro mm -hmm. I recommend you to stop by uh, Herzeg Novi visit the city the old town like we did today you can yeah. spend Either one full day or either one night is enough. Mm -hmm. We recommend you to get an accommodation yes, that uh, close, close to, to the, the city centre. By walk you can go really everywhere within a couple of minutes. Like where we stay right now. Okay guys, that's all for today. And see you in the next video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share with friends and family. And comment below if you have any recommendation or any question. Just Comment down below, okay? Stay tuned for more. See you on the next one. See ya. Ciao. Bye.